Welcome to the 8th annual Tim Hortons Charity Bass Fishing Tournament. Now this tournament has been called the Hook'em and Hold'em Charity Bass Tournament and it's in lieu of or for the Tim Hortons Children's Foundation. So what we do here is we get a bunch of professional anglers who bring out their full blown bass rigs and they take out two clients for Tim Hortons who pay to be out on the lake all day and enjoy the uh, fishing that the lake has to offer. And by the way, that happens to be Lake Scugog, one of our best premier largemouth bass fisheries in southern Ontario. And it's all about having some fun out for the day and raising funds for the Children's Foundation. Um, right now, all the boats have gone out. We're waiting for them to come back in. They're setting up the stage. And in a little while, everybody will be pulling in, and we'll see what kind of fish they bring in. Usually, you're going to see some nice big bass. So hopefully, when they come in, we'll be able to show you guys some of these beautiful fish. Now this tournament is not strictly about bass fishing. We also have a couple of more features in the event to help raise funds. After they come back in from fishing, everybody gets to participate in a silent auction to help raise funds. And then they have a nice big poker game, which also helps raise funds for the Tim Hortons Children's Foundation. Uh, and then once all that's said and done, there's a big meal put out for everybody. So everybody enjoys a great dinner, a little bit of camaraderie, and then everybody, of course, heads back home. We've been, like I said, running this for eight years. Everybody has a really good time. Uh, and the main goal is to enjoy yourself, maybe catch some fish, but the big goal is to raise funds for our charity foundation. And uh, that's what we're here for. I think you did. You won here, have you not, Rob? I have won. You have. Just not today, though, right? No, not today. No, Just not today. But that one is a really nice fish. That's a quality fish. Did you get a big rock bass to go with him? No. No, I tried to net a sunfish, but it went through the, the trick is to keep feeding the big fish your rock bass until he fattens up before you bring him in. Total weight is 7.390. Another guy without a big smile on his face. What's up with this? Smile! Smile! <laughs> you lost a big one, did you? Let's see what he's got. It started off at 14 pounds, but it's going down quick. <laughs> That's not bad. It's all, it's, all, it's all in one fish, isn't it? You think you got better than a 4-3-3? No. No? Show him that nice big smallmouth. Nice fish. Dan Rosardo. Dan is team number 36. Let's see what Dan's got. Oh, I see some fish in there. That looks good. Are you sure that's only three fish? How big is this way? I'm going to have to check. I'm going to have to check that out. That looks like a smug. That looks like more than three fish. You better check that out. Yeah, there's too many. Too many fish? Yeah, too many. Hmm. What do we got here? Nine point six two three, I think, or six three. Let's see what it says. Three fish for nine point six two zero. Way to go, Dan. Well, I thought you were going to hold up the rock bass. <laughs> Here comes number thirty-five. Here comes big fish. Uh oh. Oh, look at the belly on that. I got one. Whoa. That's why you took that big breakfast with you, eh, Scott? You fed the fish. Oh, that's a big one. Oh, oh my lord, this is a big fish. Big fish. Healthy looking, too. That is a nice fish, Scott. 
should have left that for me next week for my tournament. Okay, I'll put it back. Put it back for me, yeah. Oh, look at the size of this. Go, Primo! Kate, <laughs> ugly one. Oh, yeah! Look at that! Oh. Ain't that a monster? <laughs> <laughs> next up is Buck Teitler. Where is T Bucky? Bucky is number 45. Buck, should I mention that you're a uh, crowd favorite and a local? I guess I just did by accident. Doesn't matter, it's better. Alright. Not bad, Buck. Nothing wrong with that. You got a big one? Just big? Big panfish? You're classifying your largemouth as a panfish. Absolutely. Look at that killer. <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay, so this team here has got a total weight of 4.900. <laughs> Hold up these fish. Hold up these monsters. Now, isn't that a happy team? Look at that. There we Teamwork. Go. Dan Risotto. Dan. Risotto! Dan, can I call you your nickname? Hey? Can I use the nickname? Yeah. Sure, why not? Dan is uh, fondly named the Gooch. Danny the Gooch. Risotto. Congratulations, buddy. Way to go. Congratulations. I'm going to that. He's going to hold this up for a picture.